one of the assumptions of a good regression model is that there should be linearity between dependent and independent variables in SPSS we can easily determine whether there is any linear relationship between dependent and independent variables so this tutorial is on the linearity test I have already prepared a data file and let's open it here is my data file um, here y is the dependent variable and x1 x2 x3 are the three independent variable so what we have to do uh, just go to graph and click on chart builder this box may not come in some versions of SPSS but if it comes it's okay if it uh, it's not coming then it's also okay if it comes then click on ok and a new dialog box will appear here uh, the middle box is just blank what we have to do under the graph option there are uh, a number of a number of uh, types of graphs so from here what we have to do click on scatter slash dot in the sc scatter slash dot you will find a number of uh, scatter plots for linearity checking purpose I'm just choosing the first one and what I have to do is drag it in the blank box here a new uh, scatter plot is created here we see y axis and x axis y stands for dependent variable and x is for independent variable as in my uh, as in this model y is the dependent so i have to drag y in the y axis and um, i may drag x1 or x2 or x3 in the x-axis but not all the independent variables at a time but I have to do only I have to work with only one suppose I uh, at first I want to check whether y and x3 has linear relationship or not so drag y in the x-axis now click on ok the scatter plot is now generated here <coughs> this is the first this is the second third fourth um, fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth if we uh, look from a broader context we can assume a line a diagonal line that starts from the uh, lower left and rises to the uh, upper right just like in this way this way from left to right and uh, lower to upper from here we can conclude that as we can assume a linear a line a straight line from left to right and uh, which is also uh, from lower to upper so we can conclude y and x3 has linearity I mean these two variables have linearity between them this is a good sign for a good regression model so this is the case then what uh, I want to know whether y has linearity with x2 and x1 so uh, let's do the same thing now I want to know x2 and y so drag x2 in x now click on ok 
and uh, let's uh, see here the first one first data point is here then the second data point is here second data point is downward third data point is more downward then the fourth one is upward fifth one is upward more upward and the sixth and seventh are downward and uh, eight data point is upward just like uh, uh, downward upward downward upward so we cannot build a straight line for these data points and we can conclude y and x2 don't have linearity and uh, lastly I want to see whether there is linear relationship between y and x1 so the same thing now drag x1 in the x position and click on ok so it came this is simple scatter of y by x1 here uh, just like the first scatter plot of y and x3 the third one the current one is also uh, has shows linearity just like we can assume a straight line from left to right and uh, lower to upper end so and uh, we can say that y and x1 has linear relationship this is the case and finally what um, we can conclude uh, is that uh, we can exclude x2 and it's better to exclude x2 from this model as y and x2 uh, don't have linear relationship between themselves so this is the case and uh, this is the ending of video and in this way you can uh, determine whether your data has uh, whether your data contain any linear relationship among themselves or not so um, thanks for watching and uh, if you have any comment or criticism just feel free to uh, write in the comment section and finally thanks again